So it's made it easier to communicate. I can use the app to communicate with them and let them know like what I've done or what needs to be done. And they can do the same if they're busy. They can just make a ticket really quick and let me know what I need to do. And it's really hard to communicate one-on-one -on -one with every single person throughout the entire day. Um, it's almost impossible. And using Prosper um, has really helped that one-on-one -on -one communication. If you're used to making handwritten lists, you have to kind of transfer over into Prosper. It just, it makes it a lot easier. It's a lot easier and less scary than it sounds. It's a lot more user-friendly, and I really like the schedule feature on that because you can see a lot easier who you're working with day to day, and they can make a list for us on the task feature when, with things that are close dated or other things that need to be done. So it's easier to keep up with tasks and stay on track with the whole crew. Really favorite features is called the broadcast and what's really cool about this feature is i'll type up one message and it will go individually to every person that's in that group so when they reply to you it's not going to every person that's in the group it's only coming back to me which is a really cool feature the prosper app has really helped us create tasks and help keep our declines lower and keep us on top of things that kind of get lost it has saved us thousands in declines in just the few months we've been using. You really have to embrace it. You have to go all in. The department managers had to be involved and they have to be using Prosper and, you know, relaying information through Prosper. I mean, it's really just a habit. Um, you know, once they get in the habit of looking at the app or using the app to request off or using it to make a to-do list or to make a ticket, it's second nature. Anytime somebody comes to us with an issue or uh, something that needs to be done, we automatically tell them now, make a ticket. They're in the habit now of making tickets. A lot of times they don't even ask us anymore. They just put a ticket on there, we'll see it or whoever needs to do it sees it and it just gets done. I mean, it's really just a habit. Um, you know, once they get in the habit of looking at the app or using the app to request off or using it to make um, a to-do list or to make a ticket, it's second nature. You know, once we roll this out into stores, cut off ties with crew. Um, and I know that's going to be hard because it was hard at my store as well, but I monitored crew and made sure that people weren't messaging on it. And when they were, I would tell them, hey, you need to get on Prosper and put the message on Prosper. I'd say go 100% like we did. It makes it the easiest transition.